Hello, vinyl community. Chris Profi, Musically Obsessed. Um, I probably should have done this video a long time ago, but I want to give you a tour of the apartment. I don't really have a music room. I've got a two-bedroom apartment uh, where I keep my music in all kind of different places. I mean, as you can see, I got my Pink Floyd Animals poster, Miles Davis, Bitches Brew, um, Little Beatles action. Uh, it's Christmas time in New York, so I got my Christmas tree up. There's my kiss ornament. And this is a cool poster. This is when I saw Roger Waters at Yankee Stadium live. He performed The Wall. Awesome. There's my TV. And underneath my TV, I have uh, my just my Broadway CDs. So... Avenue Q, Aida, a little night music, some Sondheim stuff, Evita, uh, Monty, or uh, the Full Monty, Into the Woods, Godspell, Jesus Christ Superstar, uh, Music Man, Baker's Wife, Pippin, the producers, Rent, uh, Working, uh, Sunset Boulevard, The Wedding Singer. So a whole bunch of Broadway. Now I'll walk you over to where. I keep my vinyl. That's a Kallax uh, uh, IKEA storage that I got. And uh, I have a Music Hall MMF 1.5 turntable that I love. Currently, I've got a Iron Maiden Somewhere in Time on there. Um, Edifier desktop speakers. Perfect for uh, my apartment. They're small, but they, they give off a lot of great sound. There's my crappy CD player. I've got a CD player in my car as well. This is what I was listening to currently. Miles Davis Water Babies, Jack Johnson. Get Up With It. Forgot the title of that for a second. This is a great album and big fun. Um... And then I always kind of put up on the wall what I'm currently listening to, do, to so there's somewhere in time. Um, again, I love that little, I love my setup. It's not too big, but it's perfect for what I got. Perfect for my space, too. Um, there is uh, my Christmas collection since it's December. Christmas CDs. Got some Kiss dolls. These were the uh, pop figures of Metallica. This is the other side. And uh, I'll just kind of show you some of the vinyl here. Just a varied here. Black Sabbath, Technical Ecstasy, Johnny Cash, Destination Victoria Station, a little night music, Sondheim. Um, what else? The Best of Crow. Depeche Mode 101. Hey, my son just got home. Hey, Alan. Hello. I'm just shooting a video of the apartment. My kids are used to this by now. Uh, what else? Dicks. Um, big Donovan fan. Love is only feeling. Herbie Hancock. Um, Husker Du. Maiden. Uh, what else I got in here? Jefferson Starship. Jesus and Mary Chain. Killer Dwarfs. I think I got some Crocus in here too. Oh yeah, Crocus. Joni Mitchell. The Monkees. Uh, Mike Nesmith solo stuff. This is a great Sondheim musical. Pacific Overtures. Uh, Buck Owens, 
Saccharin Trust, Slayer, Steppenwolf for ladies only. Um, what else? Great band called Swa, punk band on the SST label. Um, Tom Tricali's Dog, Three Penny Opera, Venom, Ina Kleina Knock Music, um, Wings Over America, a band called Worm, Yes Songs, Neil Young. Um, so a whole bunch of stuff. There's my newest uh, acquisition, Michael Nesmith's uh, Post Monkeys album. Actually, he, I think he recorded this album when he was with the Monkeys. It's called The Wichita Train Whistle Sings. And there's my Motorhead uh, box of magic. Now, let me walk you to the back where I keep a lot of my other CDs. Uh, don't mind my kid's room. It's uh, extremely messy. I'm going to hopefully not show you too much about that. So here's the closet. This is where I keep my CDs, the bulk of my CDs. And um, I don't know if I told you already, but I've got a, about 14 bins of CDs at my parents' house in storage. It uh, equals out to be about 3,000 CDs, but this is just like the tip of the iceberg. Um, and then I've got, uh, that's where I, that's when I saw Mike Nesmith and Mickey Dolan's. I got these cool pins. There's my Johnny Cash box set. Uh, I got some cassettes, lots of SST cassettes, some box sets, collections. Here's Tigers of Pantang. I got bread. Uh, Husker Du, Grateful Dead. Uh, and then up top here, I've got some box sets over there. I did some reviews of those. Uh, here's my jazz collection. So it starts here and goes all the way down to the ends. I've got everything from Miles Davis to Herbie Hancock to Mingus to Weather Report, uh, Chick Corea, Grover Washington Jr., um, everything's in there. Al Demiola, Duke Ellington, great stuff. And here's my CDs. Uh, yeah, I'll just kind of walk you through some of that, except Alan Parsons, Anthrax, The Association, Atomic Rooster, Bad Religion, Blaze Bailey, uh, Black Country Communion, Black Flag, um, what else? Blind Guardian, Black Sabbath, Junior Brown, Budgie, uh, The Birds, Camel, Camper Van Beethoven, Captain Beyond, Johnny Cash, Charled, Charred Walls of the Damned, uh, Eric Church, Leonard Cohen, Coroner, oh, Coroner's great. Uh, Corrosion of Conformity, The Cranberries, uh, Warren Dane, Death, Deep Purple, Neil Diamond, Dio, uh, Fate's Warning, Firehose, Fleetwood Mac, Dan Fogelberg, Ace Fraley, Peter Gabriel, David Gates, he was the lead singer of Bread, Genesis, Gentle Giant, there's my Ian Gillen, Solo Collection, David Gilmore, Tom T. Hall, uh, Hatchet. Hatchet's a cool band. They're like a new thrash band. Uh, Husker Du, Janice Ian, Iced Earth, Iron Maiden, Jefferson Starship, Jeff Jefferson Airplane, Priest, Kansas, King Crimson, uh, Creator, King Diamond, L.A. Guns, Leaf Hound, Led Zeppelin, Marilyn, Megadeth, Metallica. Like I said, this is not all my CDs. Bob Mould, Motorhead, Morbid Angel, Van Morrison, Moxie Fruvis, Nazareth, Nectar, Mike Nesmith, Overkill, 
Ozzy, Peter, Paul, and Mary, Pink Fairies, Pink Floyd, Petty, uh, Prince, Public Enemy, Queen Raven, remember Raven, Lou Reed, Saccharin Trust, St. Vitus, Satyricon, Saxon, Screaming Trees, Sinatra, Sleep, Patti Smith, The Smiths, Sonic Youth, uh, Swa, Taylor Swift, Tar Babies, uh, Tiger Army, Tragically Hip, they're a band out of Canada, Typo Negative, UFO, Vanilla Fudge, Voivod, Venom, Bill Ward solo album, uh, Wire, X, XTC, Zappa, Y&T, Dwight Yoakam, Yes. So a little bit of everything. Um, so that's my apartment. Um, so when I talk about music, I really feel like I do know quite a bit about music. So um, thanks for watching. I'll bring you back out here again. And uh, this is where the magic happens. So I will end with my Miles Davis photo. All right. See you soon.